A woman of leisure. Well, well, welcome to our rescue, young drivers and blades. May I ask if you are all properly equipped with accessories? Accessories are not just baubles, you know, they are part and parcel of the driver's gear. You got your hats, your chokers, your amulets, and so on. Each item has different effects, as you can see. And young things are always questing. I'll bet that there are some accessories that could really help you on the way. You know, my granddaughter has an accessory shop in town. You should stop by and try it if you fancy. Nice. Plugging the granddaughter. You're coming with me, treasure. Speaking of accessories. Engines of Calm. Hmm. We made it. Good stuff. Doesn't seem so bad. Okay. What was this here? What a pleasant stroll. Right. Where shall we head to next? Okay, so we need to get... We didn't have high enough stat, right? So... Let's go to a camp real quick. Hmm. What a pleasant stroll. Right. Where shall we head to next? Aren't we in trouble? Nature makes a fine ally. What? You found the treasure? Really? Wow, so that no palm was telling the truth after all. Hope you won't hold it against me for bothering you with such a little misunderstanding, will you? And thank you ever so much for getting to the bottom of my little mystery, even if it wasn't much of one. Like I promised, the treasure's yours. There we go. You have my thanks. Okay, still need five more. Aren't you glad you asked us? You can rely on me. Master More fisticuffs f Think of it is an odd Okay Let's see it was a talisman Stitch by stitch um, Be careful now I don't s I think it was one of these, though. Maybe she doesn't have the recipe yet? Still need another what sixteen green pollen or red pollen orbs? Get down to business. Oh, 
It's ready. It's ready. Shall we get started? Okay. We must hurry to the court of Torn and King to make known Malice's foul intent. You're right. The sooner we can deliver a report, the more chance we have of averting the carnage that Malice hopes to bring. Let me specify way out in front of the palace. I've got a bad feeling about this. How bad are we talking? Actually, you guys will be fine. Don't pay too much attention to my weird hunches. Okay, if you say so. Hmm. You just push on. I think there's still a ton of treasure out there in the Danic Desert just waiting to be found. I've been thinking about hiring an adventure with a taste for mining to help me find some. You guys had a blade that was good at mining, didn't you? If, you th if so, you think you'll be able to find lots of treasure, not just here, but in all sorts of other places. If I find any treasure before you, though, I don't think I'm going to be handing it over. Finders keepers, it's just fair. Hmm. Well, 42, 38. over here a bit a little higher level I'm not much exploring Water, a little bit serve my will I love the fact that all of my blades are always equipped so I never have to swap them out to do something like that high level up here Okay, let's just continue on with the main story for now. Like, to do this quest over here, we need to have break. Yeah, okay, let's just wait. We'll do the main story. That was a nice change of pace. I wonder if there's right. like more than enough green barrels or if I've missed some. Oh, there's some right there. We there's your answer. The suspense is killing me. You're coming with me, treasure. Okay. Aren't we in I know the drill. To the palace. Lemons. We made it. Lord Adam and your majesty Emperor Hugo. I think there must be some sort of emergency. Quest your mouth is also gracing us with his presence. Oh boy. What is the mouth is up to right now? Malos aims for the seal? Yes. He draws ever closer to the capital. Leaving destruction in his wake. Our path here was littered with the wounds of his procession, my lord. So, the quester's report was true. Noble Hugo. At this time of grave peril, you have afforded us your trusty aid. Your due will be our eternal thanks. 
I'm scarcely worthy of it, Your Majesty. As the Titans breathe, I merely followed Prince Adam against the peril we face. In truth, it is to him that your kind praise is due. Ah, the trust of the dread Ardanian throne. Tis a much valued gift to our <laughs> hey, Echo. Of a letter. I am a little tired. It gladdens me. Your most noble honors pierce my unworthy heart, my lord. Begging your pardon, lord, would that honor were the only currency in this grave business. An armed band transgressed the sacred boundaries of the capital without regal assent. The act merits bitter punishment. Suppose you that our soldiers can subdue Malos alone? I... I don't... Indeed. The army of resistance fearlessly dashes to our nation's aid. They tremble not in the face of the mightiest of foes. To punish them is unthinkable. Yes, but... Zeta, what does not bend only breaks. We must suffer to Adam his just bounty. I hereby enfeef you as Lord of Heblin. Uh-oh. This is too much for me, my lord. First, I must busy myself with the command of the resistance force. We can't allow Malos to take the seal. I'd be much obliged if you could grant permission for the resistance to move freely within your lands, Lord. As you wish. Brave soldiers of Torna, hear your king. Our country must make its own sacrifice to halt the terrible power of the Aegis. Indul II pledges its flesh and blood to the cause. Mm -hmm. I humbly confess that it was my own lack of foresight which brought us to this pass. Lots of story today. <laughs> my brother, or rather, my lord, what is your aim? Why give Heblin to Adam? He has declined our offer. Perhaps our good wishes suffice. Yet still, he holds all the power. He makes allies of foreign lords without permission and gathers together a fighting force. Hmm. Zeta, my brother, hear me well. The sickened world rests heavy upon my crown, I fear too heavy for my mortal neck. Ma majesty And this disorderly throne is more apt for one such as Adam. Oh, no, Mom. Brother. You mean to set my birthright on the caitiff's shoulders? Well, that's not going to go over well. Oh, I can finally breathe. What's wrong? You got asthma or something? It's all right. There's no need for concern. Lady Laura gets like this whenever she has to deal with formal situations. That's not ideal. You're one to talk. You've been waiting outside the whole time, just idling by yourself. That's so selfish. Cut up some slack, Laura. Minoth had good reason not to go, especially when his least favorite individual was intended. Least favorite? Wait, you mean a Malthus, don't you? I'm sorry, I didn't. It's fine. I'm a coward. I admit it. His least favorite individual is his own driver. <laughs> we should endeavor to make sure that Minoth steers well clear of the Quaster in the future. So, Adam, what's our next course of action? We may have warned them in time, but there's no telling when Malus might launch his next hit. Might launch his attack. Indeed, we can start by taking a stroll around the city and seeing what the residents have to say. You can't be serious. Malus is virtually breathing down our necks, and you want to waste time catching up? That's not what this is. We'd get to learn the lay of the land too, and we'd get an idea of the overall mood. He's right. Establishing a good rapport with the residents will give us an edge when the time comes. Perhaps the Aegis feels that she can handle the situation all on her own. Fine, whatever. You all know better than me, so go on ahead. Bunch of bullies. We're not saying it to be mean, Mithra. We all have to make concessions. I think even you understand that now. You've really matured, you know. Am I supposed to take that as a compliment? 
He should. Adam's been looking out for you this whole time, you know. It's, he's being honest. He's being honest. Agreed. We should take his praise at face value. Now, let's set to exploring the city. Plenty of atmosphere to soak up. So how are you doing today, Echo? Welcome back to the stream. New recipe, Oyster. We don't know when the Aegis will turn his gaze toward the capital city. In the meantime, please rest up and explore the city. There are always soldiers stationed at Aqua Watchtower. They'll spot the Aegis coming. If that happens, we'll let you know right away. Okay. I already went up here, right? Yeah, it was like the tower. There wasn't two of them, was there? No, okay. Aren't we intrepid? Yeah, as for being tired, I'll be okay. I just need a little bit of caffeine. <laughs> I, um, you know, work a full-time job, stream five hours a day, edit videos, get it all uploaded to YouTube. At some point I have to sleep. <laughs> I also have wife and kids. There's a, lot, there's a lot going on, right? It's been busy at work, so. I didn't get as much sleep as I should have this week. But we will do better in the future. Now, what do we need for this guy over here? The we need to go try the machine out or something. Ooh, there's a quest here. No customers. Nothing to do. Welcome to the OBB's textures textiles. Oh, friends, not customers. Oh, BB, not have time for window shoppers, please, to scram. What do you mean I not look busy? It's none of friends' business. But friends make valid observation. Nobody come to check out wares of OBB patience is coming into rope. Not sure why, but even other no plans need to keep distance. Maybe time to pack up shop. If only there were an easy way to rake in buckets of gold in one fell swoop. OBB has it! OBB recently spied a little pond around town, never seen before. Little Pond traveling alone at young age is only one possibility. Must be Little Pond of Arrest's hottest trade guild, name of Voltus. Would owe great debt if friends could ask Little Pond for big inspiration. OBB, wait right here, looking forward to news of good news. Ooh, Cold Steel I'm 3? That's awesome, dude. Run. Sadly, I don't know much about those games. I wish I did. Ah, aspirant youths, stay right where you are. You have the look about you that tells me you might be interested in one of my most marvelous inventions. Here, look, I have hundreds of things. Beauties, aren't they? More ordain has absolutely nothing on my masterworks, I tell you. I am nevertheless at somewhat of a loss as to how to surpass my former genius. With What with the war on the horizon, it's been getting more and more difficult to try and find the parts I need. So now I've laid my woes bare. Could you perchance help the great Gideon collect some machine parts? I believe the ones lying around here in Torna should be choice enough. Well, I think I have enough of those. I see there's work to do. How do? You have some machine parts? Yeah, just a few. Oh, I have sun cogs. When did I get those? Sun cogs are one of the things that we were waiting on. Excellent work, a fine haul you have there. I extend my gracious thanks. At long last, I can now put the finishing touches on my ultimate creation. I call it Gideon's Special Patented Perpetual Music Box. As the name suggests, with just one turn of the key, it'll play music forever and ever with no interruption. Huh, what's that? You wanna know how to stop it? Well, <laughs> that's a good point. I've not thought of a good way yet. I think that's a problem for future Gideon to wrestle with. Anyway, you've helped me collect the parts, so why don't I teach you how to make your own my as thanks? So like, oh yes, hold on, it's coming to me. Yes, yes, Eureka, I've got it. A flash of inspiration for a brand new invention. My next masterpiece that will address any and all minor flaws that the last masterpiece may or may not have had. 
And for that, I'm gonna need lots of parts that can withstand the dry climate around the capital. I hear tell that you can find those parts around Gormot. And I trust and rely on you to help find a few more parts. I probably already have these ones too. Um, if you had a music box, then once you start playing it, it plays forever and you can't stop it. That sounds horrible. <laughs> you just like hear this, like the, the same little music box song over and over and over again forever. Is Nocturne Remaster going to be on the PS4 or just Switch? Be on the PS4. Perfectly tuned mechanism cancels out any noise from surroundings and magnifies the user's voice. And since surely everyone loves the sound of their own voice, there's no need for an off switch. I'm brilliant. Huh? How far does the magnified voice carry, you ask? Oh, what are you guys, health and safety inspectors? Sheesh. Thanks to my ingenious directionalizing technology, any voice you feed it, no matter how loud, will carry 10 peds. Right, just about as far as you shout. That's pretty much the point. <laughs> Here, I'll share the resume with you. All you can take is my groundbreaking invention out into the world. It seems your contributions have allowed me to stay aloft after all. This marks the beginning of a new era of inventions. Why, before you know it, I'll be a household name. People will bow and scrape before me, begging for one of my creations. And I owe it in part to your keen-eyed kittywinks. Bravo. Well done, indeed. Awesome. Community. SMT5 is just Switch, though. Ooh. I'm glad I have a Switch. Look at all of those people. Oh, it looks like the Royal Capital was a big chunk of it, huh? We're almost up to community level two. Aren't you glad you Ooh, a new moon cube. Don't mind if I do. I do believe. Yeah, it's double attack. Let's take this from Adam. finally got good news about it. I was starting to think it was a dream. Yeah. I'm just saying, like, we're gonna... We're gonna be finishing this game probably Monday, and then we'll start Xenogears. And Xenogears... Xenogears is probably, like, at least two weeks, I'm guessing, on the stream. I'm not sure exactly. I've never played it before. But it's not as short as this one. In Xenosaga, there's three games. Each one of them is, like, what, like... 20 or 30 hours so that'll be a few weeks it's you know chronicles x will take god knows how long but after all that's done we got to pick another series to do and i am still looking for suggestions still hungry they not serve big portions here you want omnom or something omnom in the middle of meal now will help later wait hold thought of omnom friends not happen to have food. This place make Omnom angry, never feel full after eating. If friends have food, could share some with Omnom, pretty please? All right, we'll give you some food. A lot of these quests are just like, collect these items I for me. We'll be able to and help. I just have done so much of that already. It's just like, okay, here you go. <laughs> All right, so this is things that we had to actually cook. 
but we don't need very many of them. And I want dessert. Ascension waffles are not worth much. <laughs> Ooh, these platinum bonbons are, though. Let me make some of those. What should I do? Sorry, I don't mean to mumble in front of customers. I was miles away. I've got this friend, you see, and lately he's been, I don't know, distant, absent-minded, just a bit weird, I guess. He stopped eating his favorite fish dishes. Oh, I know something's up, but he won't talk to me about it. Maybe, maybe you could get through to him? Would you do that for me? His name's Joey. Can you find him tending to the armor? Sorry to bother you with this little thing like that. Hopefully it's nothing at all. Anyhow, thanks so much. I'd like you to trust us with this. So many quests. Boss is busiest business pawn at market. As far as Secretary Popolo know, he married to work. Must be hard being chairman. Ah, maybe truth is he's working too hard. Popolo would want him to take it easy. Popolo would prefer a normal relationship than marriage to job. Maybe also holiday? Sorry, I was saying that out loud. Anyway, trader, boss is trader among traders, no doubt. All right. Yep, yep. Cool. And our weeks is for all. I'd like you to trust us with this. Okay. Here's Joey. Huh? Yeah, I'm Joey. What's it to you? What, Tico sent you? God, so nosy. I told her already, everything's okay. Fine, you really want to know? Three of my armies have run away. My own dumb fault, I thought I'd see if armies have a homing instinct. Spoiler alert, they don't. Not a single one of them got back. What a waste of time. So, uh, if you see any armies running around, could you please maybe bring them back here? I think you could probably find them easy enough if by following the tracks. Names of the three lost armus are Yama, Aji, and Wash Washish. They should come when you call them, and don't try to, like, fight them or tip them over, okay? Cheers and all. So many quests. Good travelers, can I ask you something? I'm not sure if you've noticed, but the lantern at the side of the gate has gone out. Doesn't that bother you? Right, like, what's the point in even being here? I've been hoping to get it repaired, actually. See, I'm supposed to monitor the area, so I can't afford to leave my station, not even for a second. As for the guy next to me, well, he's my brother, but for reasons I prefer not to go into, I'd rather not ask him. You can talk to him if you want, you'll soon understand. In any case, I've got to get my duty and keep watch over this place. I'm stuck at my post, lantern's out of reach. You probably guessed where it is I'm going. Think you could light up my life a little bit? That's out of your reach, huh? I saw the whole thing. Awesome work. You've really brightened up my day. It takes care of that matter then, which brings me to the next one. See, there's actually a bunch of lanterns that are broken down around the capital. I happened to notice them while I was on patrol and it really bugged me. And that's usually my brother turned a blind eye to the problem. So being the model citizen that I am, I thought I'd take the initiative and fix them all myself, except I haven't been able to do that yet, not since I've been lumbered with guard duty. I reckon there there were about four in total. One in Formide Shopping Ward, one in the Fabi Industry Ward, one in Oresco Residential Ward, oh, and the last one was in Orm Storage Ward. If you could nip around and fix those four would be a huge help for me and for the people. Okay.
Here in Torna, we revere the might of the Titans. It's essentially our religion, though it's not like we have much in the way of special rituals or rules. We just believe in respecting the life that surrounds us. Titans, humans, blades, we're all the same, really. Every one of us is a gift to the world we live in, and sometimes it can be good show to show our gratitude for that. Oh, it's already on. Friends have business with Deku Deku? Ah, indeed, it's true. Deku Deku on Waki Waki Pilgrimage, special rite of passage for Voltus Trade Guild. Is making only me minor impression, me know, but please realize Deku Deku carry future of Trade Guild on back. It take budding young aspiring merchant to self generate to generate strong cash flow. Friends take interest in Deku Deku and need to ask favor. So textile shop doing poor business and asking Deku Deku to invest. Very interesting proposal. It's perfect opportunity to put financial skills to test. But not an expert res not but not to expect results immediately. Deku Deku need time to draw up business plan. It's no easy road to success. Getting rich quick scheme is pie and sky way of thinking, even if sound delicious. Okay, Deku Deku, go ahead and have a talk with manager now. Fully understanding the situation is key to every successful business transaction. We'll consider options on the table and get back to friends when returned. 